Arena Breakout Infinite is a new FPS extraction shooter that is deemed to be the Tarkov killer. I'm going to show you my first impressions playing this game, what it's like, and the performance and things like that, so you can get a better understanding of what you can expect. It is in closed beta for around a week, I think, and I do have access, so I'm going to try and post many videos on this game to get you guys up to speed. If you enjoy this video, hit that like and subscribe button, and let's get into the game. Alright, we have spawned into a arena breakout raid, and you guys do not even know how mad I am. I've literally recorded three videos, including my initial impressions, and this is what they look like. What the hell? Why was he so loud? I think that was a PMC. Um, anyways, so I recorded literally three videos on this game. I had a raid where I killed four PMCs or whatever you want to call them. Operate. Oh. Four operators and none of that footage can be used because I didn't have my OBS set up correctly. So this is going to count as my, I guess, new first raid to show you guys this game. So as you can see there, we just spawned in. We've killed a few things. I don't know if any of them were, any of them were actually operators, but pretty decent start. I might just check a few bodies here if I get the chance to see exactly what I have been killing. So we'll start with this guy here. This actually looks like, yep, that's a player over there. And I might run to that red car just to have a look and see if who I killed here was also a player. Because they may have been together, but I don't know. So I've really been enjoying this game. I've been playing for maybe one or two hours at the moment. I really wish I could use the footage that I recorded. But obviously I can't because I screwed up. So let's hope I get another good raid. Because one of the raids I killed four people. And I was really excited about that. I wanted to show you guys it. But once I found out my settings weren't correct, then my fun quickly went out the window. So my first impressions of this game are it is really fun. The frames you get, as you can see, I'm using a 1080 and I have 80 FPS, which honestly, in my opinion, I think that is ridiculously good. I think there's an AI here. There was an AI there. Okay. So, performance-wise, I think the game runs very, very well, at least for me. I have heard some people having a few issues with it, but it is what it is. I'm going to actually go out this way, just because I'm hearing a lot of shooting. So, maybe I can sort of repeat the PvP I had in my earlier raid, which you guys obviously will not see. But, yeah, I'm not going to cut out any footage from this video. I want you guys to see the raw footage of what this game is like and things like that. I don't know why I feel like I can hear something here. Although I could be wrong. I probably am wrong. And I do have a few tasks to do. But regardless, we do need to go in this sort of direction for our quests and stuff. So I'm going to head out this way. And we'll see what happens. We definitely heard a lot of shooting out in this area earlier, so I would like to ideally get into some. Ooh. That's definitely a player in there, most likely. I don't know if I killed him. Probably didn't. Yeah, no, I didn't. He shut the door on me. I wonder if there's another way up or down in this building. Wow. Okay. Well, there was two of them in there. So we killed... Oh, we actually killed two operators, so 
two PMCs killed, I guess, is what you could say. But, yeah. I'm gonna jump into another one. Okay. So, we just had our first death, as you witnessed there. Very... Oh, something just moved in front of me there. What was I saying? Um, very, very annoyed. Oh. Okay. I think that was an AI. Uh, it is super annoying that I lost all the footage because, man, I had some really, really good, some really, really good raids. I can hear something in front of me. Okay, that might be who I saw. So, let's just keep moving. Let's just keep on moving. But yeah, I mean, it is what it is. It is what it is. I've been playing for about an hour now, and I must say I'm enjoying the game. Although, I don't think I'm really focusing too much on my quests and stuff. Which I probably should be doing a lot more. I'm just sort of trying to get used to the combat. Because I think that's going to be the most helpful. There is somebody in this town. Or little area, I should say. 100% I heard footsteps. And I don't know exactly where. So I want to make sure I don't die again. It could just be AI, which is the annoying thing, I guess. But let's try clear this. It's up top. Somebody is up top. This is a very dangerous push, isn't it? Alright, that does it. I don't think he expected me to jump around the side there, so... We sort of got the better of him with that one. What does he have on him? Let's loot up his stuff. That's worse armor. Let's check his bag. T-shaped plug. I do not have that yet, so... Let's just loot pretty much everything this boy has on him. Including the mags, just in case I have to use his gun. And maybe we'll actually check his pockets too, just for meds and stuff, because you use a lot of meds in this game. Yeah, okay, nothing too interesting. It looks like he's already looted the safe. And he's already looted this guy, so... Okay. Let's continue. Let me try and figure out which direction I need to go. So, I actually need to go this way towards my extract, so... I'm gonna go back out this way and then head to the left because I do want to survive the raid obviously I don't just want to fight people and eventually get lost and stuff so I will try get a bit of loot fill up my bag and stuff and then we will try to move out so at the moment I'm looting literally everything I can find because I don't know what's good I don't actually know what that is that looks oscilloscope. I think I'm gonna put that in here. That looks actually like a rare item in my opinion. So we'll put that in our pouch or whatever it's called and let's keep moving this way. I can, he I can hear people shooting in the distance up here so we'll have a go this way and see what we can find. But yeah, the thing I'm most surprised about is how good the performance is. I did not expect to be getting 90 FPS. Oh, down on the farm. So I've actually done an objective here, which is nice. How do I get... I might go around on the right. Uh, yeah, what was I saying? Yeah, 90 frames is honestly quite good. I only have a 1080, so I wasn't expecting to get anywhere near this level of performance. And the game itself honestly looks pretty damn nice. Let me try and figure out where these guys are. 
Maybe someone's in this large factory sort of building here. Hope I'm not running in towards my death here, but we will see. I thought I heard something. Maybe out this way to the left? If I'm not mistaken. I could be wrong. And it actually doesn't look like there's any loot in here, so... I might try and keep moving. If I can figure out how to get... There we go. This is probably the safest way to where I need to go. So I assume that if I go this way and then eventually turn left, I'm going to get close to my extract. Let me check that. Okay, I'm actually very close to my extract. So what I should try to do is actually do a bit of looting in these buildings around me. Is this where I just was? I think it might be, but it's probably worth checking because my bag is pretty empty right now. And I need to find some loot. I don't want to just come in here and not really achieve anything. Can't see anybody. Maybe this building here is the one with the loot. Okay. There's one or two people up above me. That's for sure. So, are these stairs over here? They are, okay. I don't know how well they can hear me if I'm slow walking. Why do I feel like I'm gonna die? Where are these guys? That's one. Was it just one? Maybe it was just one. If there's a second, he's just gonna be sitting here camping me, isn't he? It may have just been the one. Okay. Well, this is gonna be like all the loot we need, to be quite honest with you. Oh, he has... He has much better armor and stuff. I know this because I'm going to drop that as well. And a sports bag? Is that a bit bigger than mine? It is. It actually is. So since I'm so close to the extract, what I might do is just try and take everything in his bag. Like that. And then, we'll search for this as well. I wonder if you can make more space by using rigs and stuff. That actually might be super helpful. Let me just see. OPM bandage. So I can drop my bandages if I found this one, just to make a bit more room. These all look really good. So that takes up three slots, which is actually pretty ideal. So if I do this and that, then all I need to drop is like two things. Maybe I just drop the biscuit and then I can take that. Okay, that's awesome. That is literally awesome. I can tell I'm heavier now because I'm running super duper slowly. So now, I just need to go straight out that way. And that is my extract. So let's try and do that. And we will call this a big dub. Oh, there's an extract right there. Okay. Man, I'm very, very slow right now. I haven't been this heavy yet in a raid. So I'm not used to running this slowly, but we're right here. We killed this, this guy's probably trying to do the same thing as me, just loot up quickly and then 
extract, so... Alright, that to me looks like a lot of damn loot. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is like my first impressions on this new Arena Breakout game. I'm going to be posting more videos on this very shortly. So hit that like and subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks a lot.